A second date update. I've been waiting for Jeremiah to come on the line with us from North Hollywood. So, Jeremiah, thank you for listening to us. You met this woman how that you went out with? Uh, well, we actually met on Hinge first. Oh, Tanya, you oh, met on Hinge. That's Tanya right, met baby. Robbie on Hinge, and they got married. Or, no, they didn't get married. Right, we're getting, They're married. getting married. They're on the path. Don't put the cart before the horse there. Yeah, it's okay. They're getting married. We're planning. Oh, They're planning. She's planning. He's planning. They're planning. We're planning. Did you find a planner? No, guys. You, get, you said we were going to give it two weeks and start planning. It's two weeks. <laughs> has not been two weeks. Seems like it's been a lifetime. Yeah, it's been two weeks. <laughs> no, it really? has not. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, anyway, it's Jeremiah, so you went out four times, and she ended up spending the night, right, at, at that last time. And you say you know for a fact she had a great time, but she doesn't want to go out again or she's not talking to you? What's the deal? Yeah, I absolutely know she had a great time on the fourth date. Um, but in the middle of the night, I don't know what happened. When I woke up, she wasn't there. So she must have snuck out, I guess, while I was sleeping. Ooh. I texted her a few times, and I don't know. She didn't respond. I don't, I don't know if I did something wrong or she's got, like, a boyfriend or something like that. I, I just kind of want to know what's four, going on. You think she has a boyfriend? She went out with you four times? I, I hope not. I hope that's not the case. But, like, why sneak out and not tell me anything? I mean, just be honest, she didn't want to disturb you? What time do you think she rolled out? I don't know. I woke up around 8, which is pretty normal for me. So before but, but then. Hold on, Jeremiah. How do you know? You say in your email to us, you know for a fact she had a great time. How do you know? Right. You can tell when someone's having a good time. You know, if if she put on that kind of show, she was faking it or whatever. It just, look, she had a People good time. People fake it, bro. It. Yeah. People, People fake, fake it. it. But not that kind of fake it. Okay. That, uh, that was a but, whole other yeah, level they, of yeah. performance. That was they, Broadway performance if she's faking it. Okay. Broadway performance. Yeah, I mean, hey, worry. Okay, I feels know. like it. I they, think Broadway performance is faking it because mm -hmm. it's too over the top. Mm -hmm. No, I don't think so. I think you can feel it and hear it, and it sounded real to me. Well, okay, all right. Let's do this. It's a second date update. We have her number. Her name is Chloe. We are going to call her. We're going to find out, Jeremiah, why she left you in the middle of the night after the fourth date or in the middle of it. All right, hang on one second. This is Kiss. We'll do that next. It's going to be interesting. A second date update. I mean, did the sheet smell? We've had that situation before. Chloe left in the middle of the night on the fourth date. Jeremiah thinks she might have a boyfriend. It's Every a second time date update. you say in the middle of the night, I sing a Taylor Swift song. In the you, middle of the night, night, I left Jeremiah. <laughs> Chloe, next, second date update. Seacrest. Sister and Tanya, hello, back room. Good morning. Good morning. Why do you think she left in the middle of the night, Michaela? I don't know. Clearly something happened. Ruby, what could make you leave in the middle of the night on the fourth date? Maybe she was hungry. Mm. <laughs> you know, a little late night snack. I would just let's, eat let's whatever's there. Uh, let me get Jeremiah. We're going to find out. So Jeremiah goes out with Chloe four times. Middle of the night, fourth time. They're spending the night. She leaves. He wakes up, she's gone. Was this the first time that she had spent the night, Jeremiah? Was this the first yeah. Broadway performance you've seen? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was the first time she spent the night. He's, he says, uh, I know she had a great time based on... Well, now that what, worries me even what, more. What he, what, he, what he saw, how she reacted to the overnight. Mm -hmm. And that worries you more. Why? Because I think it has something to do with whatever happened in the bedroom that night as to why she left. He says she was, like, very theatrical. Something doesn't check right. out. Jeremiah, be very quiet. We have her on the line here. She's agreed to come on, so just stand by here. Be very quiet. Okay, we will do. Hey, is this Chloe? Yeah, hi. Hey, Chloe. Ryan Seacrest, how are you? I'm good. Can I just say I switched on Kelly and Mark just to watch your um, appearance the other day? Oh. Thank you so much. Did you see Mark throw yeah. balls at my Velcro suit? <laughs> yeah, and just and you're going to be an amazing Pat Sajak. So uh, well. Are you going to change your big, name? <laughs> big shoes to fill. What do you mean change my name? The next Pat Sajak. Yeah, you, you got some nice shoes yourself. So. Well, I'm very excited. Thank you so much, Chloe, for okay. following all you're of welcome. that. All right, well, we're going to pry into your life for a second here. You went out with a guy named Jeremiah a few times. Tell me about this guy, Jeremiah. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, a little weird. Um, I honestly wish I didn't have to talk to you about this. Um, I wish we could talk about anything else. Okay. Um, 
But uh, I did go out with a guy, Jeremiah, um, a few times, and it um, ended kind of weird. Yeah. Okay. And what was weird, though? Um, well, so the dates were great, um, and then there was just, like, a total, like, reversal. Like, it just it flipped a switch, you know? Um, like, it was great, great, great. I really liked him. Um, and then after, like, we got close, um, he just, I don't know, complete 180, like, the vibe changed dramatically. Meaning, mm. like, he was <laughs> what? You need specifics. Um, okay, what? so basically, um, after we hung out, hung out, um, mm. like, I spent the night, um, well, I stayed at his place. We hooked up, um, okay. like officially. Uh, he didn't really. He he didn't pay attention to me at all. Um, like he completely ignored me. Um, like afterwards. Just, yeah. So like the hookup was great. Um, very intense. And sorry, not to be gross, but like you know, it was great, right? Okay. Like right. super. No, I, 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 I can connected. paint the picture. Okay. Yeah. yeah, you can imagine it. Okay, so <laughs> anyway, but then it was just, like, super weird because then he, like, he ditched me. He, like, ghosted me in the same apartment. It was weird. It was, like, no aftercare, you know? God, understood. Um, uh, understood. And so that t- obviously turned you off and made you not want to, like, go out with him again or respond to him, et cetera? Yeah, it was, like, when he was done, he was just done he left the room he had a snack it was like he forgot i was even there that is um, kind of bizarre right. especially early I, on in a relationship you can do that stuff him, later <laughs> i can't let him hear more of this without asking him the burning questions oh, that i no. ask him so <sighs> uh Chloe, we have jeremiah on the line who's listening to this just please stay here oh my god jeremiah uh i mean good report card there and bad report card there so <laughs> what does that make sense did you not really pay attention after your official hookup and go get a snack? I, I mean, she, she's not 100% wrong, but I, I was hungry, so I went and got a snack. I, I, didn't I like, think she's looking for a little TLC, bro. Especially I mean, you don't after just the bail. first time. Yeah, yeah, you don't just bail for a Twix. I understand. I, I was hungry going into it, so I mean, afterwards I was hungry. Fed. Jeremiah, <laughs> forget about your appetite. I mean, or make her some food just, too. Yeah, or invite her back to the kitchen and make nachos. No, dude, he was literally playing video games. Like, oh yeah. man, but, Jeremiah, this is a, this is a classic oh. case. Is you were doing everything right and then ignoring her. So no wonder she doesn't want to hang with you again because she felt like after. The official hookup, you didn't care. Yeah. Am I putting words in your mouth, Chloe? No, I, no, you spot on. Like, he thinks that I'm no maintenance. Like, not low maintenance, just like no, no maintenance. No maintenance. You can't be no maintenance, right? <laughs> yeah. All right. So I guess we're at a interesting to hear all of this. Revealing, I will say. Chloe, thank you for your candor here. Jeremiah, yeah. you, you've heard all this. So do you want, Jeremiah, now that you've heard this, maybe you can do better, but do you, Chloe, want to go out with him again? I mean, not really. Sorry. It just, I mean, maybe you'll figure it out and we can meet again one day. I don't know. I just, but there's no, right now, not a priority. Yeah. Oh. All right. Wow. Um, yeah. It's like, I, I do you mean, guys know, you know the part in the Barbie movie when Ken's like, I want you to be my long term, long distance, low commitment girlfriend? Yes. Remember? Mm-hmm. He's like, yeah, like long term, long distance, low commitment girl. You know, and she's just like, Yeah, I would love that. Like, no, I don't want that <laughs> at all. You know? Preach so, girl. Yeah. Well Jeremiah, I, I, I think know. I think we have a conclusion here. And thank you very much for coming on. Jeremiah, good luck to you. Any response to Chloe? Yeah, I mean, I guess uh, my bad for making a snack. Uh, next time, I'll, I'll hug you for three hours before I get something to eat. Oh, okay. 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 Wow. wow. There you go. I just that you just put don't a have nail the in the <laughs> No Riz in that no statement. No Riz, Jeremiah. Not in that statement. <laughs> Oh no, we oh, I was hope I was hopeful. All right, well, Jeremiah, wish you the best of luck, pal. I hope hope this helped out. <laughs> All 
Chloe. And thank you, Chloe, Clearly for coming not. out with us. And, dude, keep a Snickers in the nightstand, bro. Right? It's not going anywhere for a while. The Snickers, isn't that their slogan? Keep it in the nightstand? No, we're, we're not going anywhere. We're not going oh. anywhere. I think it's their slogan. No, keep it in the nightstand's not their slogan, but I like it. <laughs>